na ata 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 jaza vitu vyote kwa maisha yako all your the members in your family na anaweza kugusa watu wote kwenye familia yako you save all the people that you are praying anaweza kuokoa watu wote wale waombea coming a breakthrough kuna upendo anakuja the breakthrough is now na upendo ni sasa the revival is now uwa mwisho ni sasa the big revival is now uwa mwisho ni mkubwa ni sasa so just receive the power of god pokea sasa nguvu za Mungu mahali leo now we fill you up with his spirit right now mungu atakujaza na roho yake sasa so just receive it pokea roho ya mungu sasa if you are in your home ukiwa nyumbani kwako if you sit in your car right now uko ndani ya gari yako sasa if you listen on the radio right now unataka unatusikiliza redio ni sasa do a miracle for you right mungu atafanya mujiza kwa ajili yako sasa hata tuma pesa unaotaka he will give you the house that you pray for hata kupa nyumba hiyo uliyotaka he will give you the house that you pray for hata kupa mundo uliyemomba He will do everything you want. Because he said ask me for everything. Because I said over kilo unachotaka. I will give it to you. Have faith in God. Mimi ni Mungu Believe God for big things. Muamini Mungu kwa mambo makubwa. Think big. Mambo makubwa. Because God is a big God. Kwa sababu Mungu ni Mungu mkubwa. And he is your father. Na yeye ni baba yako. And he will heal you. Na atakupona. And he he will also heal your emotional wounds nata atapona tali yako ndani all your terrible experiences ata atapona kila kitu unachopitia maybe you had been beaten up wakati mwingine auwezi zaidi maybe you have a Uh, lost a child wakati ngine umepoteza mtoto maybe you lost your husband or wife umepoteza mume au mke but god is the healer lakini yeso ni mponyaji he said i'm with you 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 with all anasema ye ni baba wa jawa ya mume wa jawa asa nimeona machozi yako nimeona tabu yako but now it's time to rest sasa ni wakati wa kuinuka upya finally i will read the mwisho nikabe nimalize nisome mstari huu and it's in the isaiah 6 Isaya sura 6. Nina kupa dada yangu kaka yangu na nisikilize. And it says in the beginning the first verse. Eh msai wa kwanza inasema hivi. You can read it. Yeah. yeah. I can arise shine. Ondoka uangaze. For the light has come. Kwa kuwa nuru yako imekuja. And the glory of the Lord. Oh hallelujah. Na utukufu wa Bwana has risen upon you. Umekuzukia juu yako. For behold and maana tazama darkness shall cover the earth giza litalifunika dunia and thick darkness the people na giza kuli tafunika kabila za watu but the lord will arise upon you bali bwana atakuzukia wewe his glory will be seen upon you na utukufu wake utaonekana juu yako and nations shall come to you na mataifa watajilia nuru yako and kings to the brightness na wafalme kujia mwanga wa kuzuka kwa lift up your eyes so the na macho yako sasa and see na utazame they all gather together pande zote they come to you wote wanakusanyana wanakuja kwa you sons shall come from afar wana wako watakuja kutoka mbali daughters na binti zako watabebwa nyongani They then you shall see. Ndipo utakapoona. And be radiant. Na kutiwa nuru. Your heart shall thrill and exult. Moyo wako utatetemeka na kuchimba. Because the abundance of the sea. Kwa kuwa wingi wa bahari. Shall be turned to you. Utageuzwa kukujia. The wealth of the nations. Utajiri wa mataifa. Shall come to you. Utakuwa asilia. A multitude of camels. Wingi wa ngamia. Shall cover you. Utakufunika the young camels of midian mabia vijana wa midian and efa na efa all those from sheba shall come wote watakuja kutoka sheba they shall bring gold wataleta zahabu and frankincense na uvumba and shall bring good news na kuzitangaza sifa njema za bwana sifa za bwana all the flocks of kedar makundi yote ya kedar yatakusanika kwako the rams of nebo nebayo na kondo wa ume wa nebayot shall minister to you watatumikia na wewe they shall come up with acceptance on my altar watapanda juu ya madhabahu yao and i will beautify my beautiful house na watajenga nyumba yao mzuri mungu awabariki sana this is powerful word yoni neno la mungu sana and god 
is in this world. And we shall pray that the Holy Spirit blow this word inside you and deliver you from depression because it came to set the captive free. But you receive the word from God today and just keep it to your heart just like Mary when she received the word from the angels you should give birth to a savior and you shall, you shall give him the name of Jesus and she carried it in her heart so in the name of Jesus we pray for you right now we pray right now let the healing power flow now to your precious people out there let them see signs and wonders let them be healed from their and arise and shine Na, no, we because the glory of God is on Kwa your life. It's on chiro. your household. Na, nyumba ya it's on your family. Na, family ya yote. And you will not forget Na, his goodness and mercy. Ye, ni mungu it sana. will always follow you. Ye, kila it will always be with you kila na because he is so close to you. Kwa yuko karibu sana na wewe. Like your own breath. Ni kama pumzi yako. So I I leave you in peace now. And I pray that God will set you free. And that God will meet all your needs. Because he has already touched you today. And he has healed you today. And God be with you and bless you so much. Thank you so much. In Jesus Yeshua's name. Amen. 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 Amen.